That's a 2,500 kilowatt hour a month power bill that you can offset with self-consumption. Uh, not to mention uh, peak shaving or uh, BPP programs. Well, I mean, we designed it to, to mount to a lot of different things. We palletized it so you can move it around and uh, get it delivered to the right space on, on the job site. The pre-commissioned options with wire coming out already connected to the inverter, where basically the inverter is live with the power switch off, um, you know, but ready to go. The smarter way to go solar. Hi everyone, Joe Ordia here for Solar Surge. And today we're coming back to you from InterSolar North America, which is the big solar conference here in San Diego. Uh, this morning I'm joined again by James Showalter, CEO and founder at EG4, and we're looking at the new EG4 Boss Box. So James, good to see you again. Thanks for joining us. Great to see you, Joe. All right, so tell us all about Boss Box. What is this? It's massive. Yeah, so again, projects versus products. We really are focused on designing projects. And uh, the Boss Box is an application where uh, we're taking the same core products we've been talking about, the, the uh, PowerPro uh, battery, which is uh, heated, outdoor rated, and uh, with all the quick connect bus bars, and we're uh, mounting an inverter on the outside and uh, placing it on a metal skid that can also bolt to a concrete pad. And so what we're trying to do here with, I think, a less than $2,000 solution is put the project in a box where we can actually pre-commission it for you and uh, get full UL certification on this dense of, you know, up to 48 kilowatt hours in a single box, which is gonna cover, again, 90, 95% of homes. I mean, that's a 2,500 kilowatt hour a month power bill that you can offset with self-consumption, uh, not to mention uh, peak shaving or uh, BPP programs. So also we've got off-grid deployments where people are just new to off-grid, they're a little uncomfortable with it. We can put their whole project in a box and they can just, it'll already be ready to go. And so they can just put it wherever they need to go. Uh, we've got homes that really don't have room for, you know, thousand pounds, 2,000 pounds of batteries and gear on the wall. Um, there are, or, or just aesthetics look issues. So we said, look, let's build a solution that, you know, is about the size of what people expect for a whole home backup generator and um, have it just run a single wire between the inverter and the grid boss, which is very much the same format that classical electricians are used to on this. So one of these angles is to get uh, more classic electricians into solar and storage, which will help with soft costs, help installers scale their business. The other one is uh, some of these uh, project, uh, you know, do-it-yourselfers and, and off-grid guys that kind of just get, get their own work done and hire an electrician. This just simplifies the whole exposure and uh, you're going to be able to have this delivered to a job site, offloaded on a skid and put in place. So just all of the tactical soft costs of just getting a job done, putting all this on a house, we think this may be a great solution for a lot of people's business models, homeowners and projects. Great. All right. So let, let's let's walk through this piece by piece for folks that are that are not familiar with this. So so weatherproof enclosure. Yeah, weatherproof enclosure. NEMA 4X. NEMA 4X. Okay. Outdoor rated. Uh, what, e each battery uh, is is a 14 kilowatt hour. Store? 14. Yeah, 14.3 kilowatt hours now, and uh, they are uh, IP65 and heated. And heated. All right. Let's talk more about the heating. So what what operating temperature range could this could this solution serve? You know, we can keep it the battery warm down to negative 20. Uh, it's still something that you should probably take into consideration when you're locating it, because of you know heating a battery is not free, right? You're you are self discharging the battery. Yeah, so yeah, it takes energy. Um, sure. If you have occasional cold snaps and you want to put it in a place that might have trouble for you know, a week out of the year, this is a great, and that's a great solution. Most of, most places in America have that uh, aspect, uh, but if you're reliably in Northern Idaho and you've got, you know, three months under 32, uh, you might want to think about putting this, uh, you know, in, in, in a medium uh, climate controlled zone. So whether garage, shop, et cetera. Uh, but we think that, you know, for probably good 70% of the country, uh, it's a great just stand alone, put it outdoors and let the heater uh, do the work on the, on the necessary days. Makes sense. Now this, the batteries are wired at 48 volts nominal? Yes. 48 volt nominal bus. There's a quick connect uh, parallel cables between these that are already pre-made. So we have a, a four quick connect bus bar and you go between the batteries on that. And of course you can take off power uh, for the inverter from some of the quick connects as well. So uh, it's, it's a really easy setup. When you buy the boss box, you're gonna be able to buy it in two ways. We'll sell you the empty cabinet and we'll sell you the fully loaded cabinet with the commissioning service included, where once you set it and use a cellular modem that we can offer, uh, then uh, we'll have somebody at EG4 actually do the commissioning for you, optimize to your power company, or, or, or be, be right there as, 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 a, as, a, as basically a, a virtual assistant that gets, gets you out of the complexity of a solar project. 
So what, what are some of the different configurations that are available if someone wanted to purchase it pre-assembled by EG4? Yeah, I think we're going to do a, a two battery configuration and a three battery configuration. I think we're going to have a stretch opportunity out here to put a fourth battery on the, on the unit. So it'll be somewhere between 30 and 60 kilowatt hours. And again, that's just, that's almost everybody. Okay. Like, uh, uh, it's, it, if you're doing a single battery, you'll probably just use a, a house mount solution. But this is for you know those folks that are trying to figure out where am I going to put all these batteries uh, to, to really be power independent. Because if you're not getting enough kilowatt hours, you know it's a gimmick. And that this this puts that the right solution in a box and makes it simple. All right. Now I, I'd like to learn more about the inverter component. Okay, James. So tell us more about the inverter that's connected up to the Boss Box. Well, you're going to have an option for either the smaller Flex Boss 18 or the Flex Boss 21. Uh, I think initially we're going to focus just on a FlexWoss 21 because this is a two or more battery solution. Okay, so James, let's say if we're if we're using that larger configuration, yeah. what can the what can the customer expect out of this? Well, I think we're going to standard ship this with a FlexWoss 21. We'll look first to see if people are looking for a FlexWoss 18 smaller inverter. But again, this solution is focused on energy independence homeowners that want the big inverter. So we'll have that inverter mounted here. It's actually the same size as the 18. They're just uh, different internals, and uh, we'll have a. Uh, the pre-commissioned options with wire coming out already connected to the inverter, where basically the inverter is live with the power switch off, um, you know, but ready to go uh, at the point of commissioning. And uh, it's a place to put the inverter. It's a complete solution. Like I say, if you're buying this for off-grid, you'll just run your power, your AC power cable to the unit and run it to your off-grid breaker panel. So you want to have an off-grid house, buy a boss box, hook us up to your breaker panel. And, and all of this is fully outdoor rated, right? Absolutely. And, or if you want to do a hybrid house, buy this box, Hook up the grid boss to your main meter collar, your meter, and uh, and run the run a single run of uh, number six, and number four wire between them. Great. So, what what are some typical applications you would see for a setup like this? What we're looking at here. Um, you know, I think that you've got uh, people who are looking for an energy independence package off grid. They're running a generator. They're trying to invest in a solution for just a no compromises off grid lifestyle. Just buy the box and don't become a don't become an expert uh, and and get get an expert to help. Um, I think you're also looking at a lot of development opportunities where you have uh, contractors that have trouble putting a battery system. Just they don't have a, just a great place on the uh, house to do it, so they're they're better off with the box. And uh, I think also you're going to see home developers start shipping these solutions with you know thousands of homes that are being built, so they can keep a, their their existing electrician doing it. Uh, and uh, they've got a spot that just fits that well. So James, is there anything else that the audience should know about the Boss Box? Well, I mean, we designed it to, to mount to a lot of different things. We palletized it so you can move it around and uh, get it delivered to the right space on, on the job site. I think a lot of guys are gonna use like all weather, uh, all terrain uh, pallet jacks or et cetera, and just get it get it in the right place. Um, and uh, it has the some really heavy bolt brackets on here to go onto a concrete pad or concrete posts or whatever else is out there for it. So. A uh, lot of options there. You got a great base, and uh, again, it just it takes your your power independence uh, needs and gets it in a nice box, and you can put it wherever you want. Great. Well, folks, this has been a brief walkthrough on the EG4 Boss Box. Uh, again, I know you all have been asking for us to do more EG4 content. We're going to have a lot more of that coming out for you this year. Uh, of course, this has been a chat with James Showalter. He's the CEO and founder at EG4. Uh, by the way, if you're getting good value from these videos that you see on Solar Surge, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Uh, also, go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. That way, as we have new videos like this coming out, it'll come up on your feed, and that way you can stay up to date with everything. But that pretty much does it for today's video. James, thanks for spending some more time Thank with you, us. Thank you, Joe. And as always, I'm Joe Ordia here, encouraging you to get prepared and be empowered. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next video.